Who are your music idols who inspired you? I've got lots of um, idols and, and uh, influences. Um, this week I've been listening a lot to a musician called Arthur Russell, uh, who was a songwriter and musician in New York in the 80s, and, or 70s and 80s I think. But there's been a lot from the classic songwriters from Paul Simon, Bob Dylan, um, and then a lot of like music like um, Steve Reich, a composer from America. He had a big influence on me as well. And how did you get involved with the Get It Loud in Library scheme? Um, I'm here in, in playing this gig uh, because they got in touch and invited me. And it, I thought it sounded like a great opportunity and something a bit different. Have you ever played in a venue such as a library? And is it different to normal? I can safely say I've never played in a library before. Normally you get told off for that kind of stuff. Um, but um, it's definitely, a, I'm looking forward to it. It's a one-off. And finally, what advice would you give young people trying to get into the music industry? I would say to younger people that it's much more available, closer and accessible than they might imagine. You know, it really is as open for you as you um, want it to be. You know, so if you think it's really difficult and, and something elusive and distant, then it will probably appear to be that way. But if you just want to make a start and realise that, that if you decide to be, you are the industry. Even if your first moves are just a little gig and just a small recording, and a, you know, everybody's first moves are, are, are initially small. But as soon as you make that move, you are the industry. And then with that mentality, it's not long until you to you become more recognisably so in the industry and what you want to be and then you'll find that you're up and running and people take you as seriously as you take yourself.